Why would I be? Why have I done this? I'm gonna take money from El Marty as well. South dead. I love this so much. South dead. It's a place. South dead. France. El Marty. What about? So it's just dead. Russia. And South dead, which is part of France. <laughs> Makes it sound like there was ever a part of Russia. Yeah. But it's not. It's alright though. It could be. <laughs> but yeah, it's it not. Could be. Alright. Alright, so if I declare war, I will be able to fire. You put all your units in position first, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'll be able to pretty much wipe out <laughs> one of them. Are you gonna do it now? What are you doing? I'm so scared. I don't know if I want to do it now. I'm gonna militarize. <laughs> I'm gonna be militarizing over here for a little bit. I'm gonna be militarizing off in the other room. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm basically better than Korea at most things. I'm just better at Korea at most things. I, I don't know. It's their fault. <laughs> Maybe if they got good, then they wouldn't be having a war on their hands. Would they? <laughs> <laughs> I keep reading that as Susan because like, my Susan. eyes aren't very good when I'm standing back here so it, it was it Boozin? yeah it's Boozin I have to be up here to actually see the D I can't see it from back here all I can see is I see Susan yeah it's Boozin if you think the chair I can't read what the other place is called so I have to declare Spol war to make it happen oh great you again <gasps> oh shit <laughs> wait 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 can I, can I see something you, give me the mouse Wait. I should demand everything. <laughs> <laughs> First, demand. Demand. Yes, if he says yes. You want to fall in here? I have nothing to fear. Oh. He thinks I'm not a threat. Because you're not a threat. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> that would be why. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, I'm gonna wait. <laughs> Problem is, my artillery is in the worst position. What I need to do is I need to say, hey, back off. <laughs> hey, back off. Alright. And then, swap with that guy. There. Okay. Perfect. I'm ready. Maybe not. I need more money. Your turn. Alright. This is M Industry. <coughs> and I'm sleepy. This is M Industry. So what? The Golden Age is dawned? Are you kidding me? Yeah. For me? For you. God damn it's all it. for you. <gasps> Happy birthday. You get a Golden Age. Uh, I, got, I just reached the Golden Age in 1912. Yes. Took a while. Yeah. I well, ah, you know, and the last horse crosses the finish line. Okay. <laughs> um. So let's see. Build great war bombers. You got a lot of oil. What would be a really good war boat? Do you suggest? You don't need. Or war bombers. Yeah, you can build war bombers. Yeah. All we have to do is be able to see the city, and then you can bomb it. Yeah. How's it going down there, South Dead? I just, I just, um... It's just a little baby. I just... You just need that bit? Yeah. I, <laughs> I, it's not against you, I just... It's basically yours. Well, like, it was just one thing in between our thing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, and you can have those areas if you want, I don't care. Right. I just wanted that part. <laughs> that part was really annoying me. <laughs> okay. Genius and tiny synthesis. But actually, but if you don't get that up, that other part soon, it's going to annoy me too, actually. <laughs> so I'll, sc I'll scrape it up. <laughs> I'm just going to scrape it. Yep. <laughs> Alright. It's mine. It's all mine. Artillery. Alright, I'm ready. I think I'm going to need a patriotic war. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Wait, you doing For the it now? people. Have you declared war yet? No, no, no. Shit, I, gotta, I just I gotta, given myself a bonus. I'm just doing something on my phone. I gotta be paying attention when you do that. It's gonna be a big moment for us. 
Well, all that's going to happen is you're just going to be in a current state of war. Mm. You're not going to be battling anyone yet. You're not going to be instantly getting bombed. We'll see about that. When but, I'm over there, you'll see, you'll see a difference. I think we need nukes. You alright? You alright, boy? You ready? Alright. You should probably upgrade to be more modern. Because, my god, you are not. That is not what you are. Farms. More farms, please. Oh, Jesus. You know. Oh, you got a little a boat between Kiev and uh, Greg. Why, oh, is that my boat? Yeah, it's your boat. What's it doing? It's going that way, I think. Is it going home? Yeah, it's going home. Alright, good. All right. I completely forgot it existed. <laughs> yeah. That's alright, though. Oh, that's right. I completely forgot you existed. Whoa, whoa. It's Wait, where's that guy going? It's, it's, going, to Van it's going to Vancouver. Shit, I'm gonna convince Vancouver. There's a you know, cargo ship. Oh, He's just trading with okay. Vancouver. No more trades. No more trades. I'm cutting you off. I'm a global power. I thought we um, guys aren't gonna be anything. I thought we embargoed Korea. We did. What's all this about? Yeah, World Congress. What happened? I will enact another embargo. <laughs> Wait, so. It's enacted. That's weird. It's no, but uh, no trade with Korea. How come they're trading with Vancouver? Is this like a glitch, or is this them being bad? Maybe, they, maybe they can't establish new trades. Maybe that's what it is. Yeah. Yeah. A bit picky. I kind of wanted no trades at all. <laughs> I think they'd be a lot more mad then, I guess. <laughs> oh, it's of course, but there's a specific reason they're mad at me, and it's because I proposed to embargo them and have no one trading with them. Yeah, thank you. Oh, my Broadway's done. I also said no to new to new uh, borders. I'm like, why did you expand out there? You should take that one, the most annoying space in I the world. I didn't, I didn't make the decision. Oh my god. My city wanted fish, and it got fish. Alright, let's see. Also, they will never ever be able to use that fish, so that was a stupid decision by them. The local government of South Dead. Excuse me while I build some more great war bombers. <laughs> yes. To assist you in your, uh... Ooh. Violent escapades. Yeah, no, I'm not doing anything over here, guys. And I just, I just, I like, I like feeling safe. It's That's right. all it is. I really like flying. I love flying and <laughs> destroying <laughs> things. <laughs> Especially when there are people involved. <laughs> yes. Um, okay. And lots of guys. Oh, yeah. What else should I build? Hmm. You could do that and get more policies. Yeah. Yeah. Atomic theory. You get more nukes. Get nukes. Yes! That's what we need. Wait for my atomic theory. Okay. <laughs> it might take a while though. Um, well, we're both working on that, so it should Who are you? Good. What do you want? He just, he, he's a musician. Oh, fine. Go make more music. <laughs> Go make music. I don't care. I need just your permission do it. to make music. Well, whoop de doo. Yeah, yeah, why do you ask me? Yeah, I don't know anything about music. <laughs> I got an entire empire to control. You ask me if you want to create some music, bugger off, mate. <laughs> do Look, what you want. This is clearly the Soviet Union where you have to ask permission to make things. Well, it is Russia. It's the Russian Empire. It's not Russia, the country that just ruined everyone's lives. Yeah, well. I'm well, here, stuck in frozen hell. Today, we make sex. I say that, and it probably wasn't as bad as people think. Have it's you, just dramatized by the US. Have you ever read the Team Fortress 2 comics? Yep. Like the the new ones that they've been releasing? Probably not. The, the big long ones that they're like this huge ongoing series? Alright. I'd recommend it. They're a good read, even if you're not playing TF2. Hmm. Because it's actually like really well written and funny and stuff. Yeah, I like the TF2 story. Yeah, well, it expands on the story. It like continues after the Man vs. Machine oh. idea. Yeah. And like actually, like it's about kind of Team Fortress too, like it's uh, they all disbanded, hmm. and then they they then like they're coming back together, and then lots of really interesting things happen. <laughs> anyway, you get to find out like what the heavy's first name is and about his family, oh. and then like the heavy sister, one of the, one of them at least starts coming with them places, <laughs> and she falls in love with the soldier. Uh. <laughs> it sounds better than it might. It's better than it sounds. Alright. Heavy's name is Misha, by the way. Yeah. yeah. 